All right, guys. So here we are back again with the uh, second part of my build of the Mirage pulse induction metal detector, and I've got the uh, the board fully populated, and we're on to calibration. So there's a quick view of the build document, talking about how to set your scope up. For the calibration, um, don't need to have the search coil attached. No speaker, headphones. Uh, I've got uh, the majority of the pots and switches attached. Got a couple things jumpered out here, uh, and as the build document says. Offboard pot and switch settings, find frequency adjust set to 50%, target sample pulse delay to zero or minimum, threshold 30 to 40%, gain to 75%, self adjusting threshold 75%, the self adjusting threshold toggle switch to on, and small gold toggle switch to on. All right, I've done all that, made the appropriate adjustments and measurements, and here's what we get on the scope. So I've got my cursor set up for what we're looking for. We're looking for uh, 65 microseconds, and you can see we're a little bit over. So what I need to do is adjust this trimmer right here where I'm pointing and I'll get lined up on the trimmer with my adjustment screwdriver and try to adjust that while you watch there we go we're at 65 microseconds and there we are I forgot to mention we're on test point five. You can see my probe here and off to the side here, the ground connection. And that's it. So next will be step two or possibly three of the process which will be looks like it jumps to step three there is no step two so step three will be set the core core transmit frequency and that'll be in the next video all right cheers